this is Sophie at Stuti's Cuisine. Hope you all are fine by the grace of God. Today I'm come with a new recipe. Hope you all will like it. Uh, more so because it's summer and it's really apt uh, to have it during summer. Today's recipe is mango pudding. It's such a quick recipe uh, which need not have any uh, steaming, you need not keep it on the fire and you need not keep it in the oven too. Yes, it takes time to set so we need uh, the cooling agent and that's the refrigerator. So let's go through the ingredients. I've taken milk, okay, and that is uh, around 400 ml, mango which is uh, pureed 400 ml and this is coconut milk, the first milk uh, 400 ml. So you can either have the powdered coconut powder which is the maggi or whichever you get it but it should be good coconut milk. I've used sugar, uh, it's up according to your taste but I'll be putting around three tablespoons of sugar for each okay so i'll be mixing it so we have also gelatin i've used the nox gelatin and i'll be using one pack for each so uh, this is the main ingredients we have to use just three you can use only with mango and milk also or only with mango and coconut milk it's as per your preference okay and i'm using gelatin and this is nox gelatin um, i'm using one pack for each of it okay i've already put one of it inside so i'm going to just mix it in it's 50 ml of each you have to mix it in cold water and then put a little boiling water to dissolve it okay this is just for setting okay so i'm just going to put all that okay and you're going to whisk it so you see just and then I'm going to put it equally into all three it's very easy and sugar it's just milk you can also make it with milk and mango uh, puree you can make it with coconut milk and mango puree and uh, just mix gelatin in all three okay and that's if you want it in layers if you don't want it in layers you can just mix uh, milk with mango and just put it in one layer okay and uh, and the sugar as per your taste so i'm thinking of putting some color into my milk so that uh, it just stands out in layers okay so i'll be putting red or green color food color so i've mixed the gelatin uh, equally amongst three and i've put the first set in the fridge for setting after which i'll be putting the second layer and then the third layer for three different ingredients you for mixing if you want it in layers if you do not want it in layers then you can just mix the milk no need of the coconut milk it's just for a little flavor and the taste i'm putting coconut milk in it which which enhances the flavor uh, of the pudding so uh, you can just mix it with plain milk and uh, mango puree I'm just showing it to you all the various varieties in which you do it and you get a three colored layer for it okay so the first batch is kept in the fridge for uh, uh, hardening so that it gets set well so after which I will be putting um, the other layer too it depends on what layer you want first okay I'm going to put the mango in in the middle sugar you can have any amount as per your taste i've just put three tablespoons each which is quite good uh, the mango is sweet enough you can put even one 
tablespoon or two tablespoons as you wish. Uh, there's no flavor in anything I put because uh, coconut has, has its own flavor, mango has its own flavor, and I just want milk neutral. Uh, its own flavor. I've just put a little coloring, food coloring to the milk with very light green uh, so that it looks like a pista color and we will see you when, when it's set. So I've just brought it out from the refrigerator. See I've just slanted it and kept it. So I'm going to put this mango slowly from the corner. Okay. for it to set so I have bought this from the fr fr fridge so it's well set now you see and now I'm going to put the third layer slowly and this is the coconut milk okay in the fridge for setting the third layer okay and uh, hi so this is the fully set mango pudding okay see so you see it's set well it takes around three to four hours to set and now we can just cut it See, we have three colored layers the pista, the mango, and the coconut. So let me see how it tastes, okay? You see how it is? So nice. And Make it yourself, it's really very easy. Also, you don't have to cook it. Uh, if at all uh, you think that your uh, milk is uh, not pasteurized, then you can just uh, boil it. Uh, if it is pasteurized, there's no need of boiling it at all. Just the gelatin can be mixed in water and then pour hot water in it let it stay for some time and then uh, pour it in the mixture and then you get it set lovely see Here. I can get the flavor and the taste of the milk uh, the mango and the coconut the three different tastes it is just super the kids will love it and even the adults enjoy don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share it amongst your friends and relatives and um, uh, give me your valuable comments okay thank you and have a great day